teenager is in critical condition this morning after an attack in the parking lot of a school on Detroit's east side. And what happened was pretty disturbing. Police say the 18 year old was repeatedly run over by a car at Fisher Magnet Upper Academy. That's right near Seven Mile and Hayes. A man walking his dog found her body on Monday morning before school started. She was rushed to the hospital and police are telling us right now they believe the teen knew her attacker. So far, no arrests have been made. The Detroit Public Schools Community District says the incident is not school related. They are cooperating with police during the investigation. In this morning, a section of I-94 in Roseville is back open after being closed for a road rage shooting investigation. State police say that a man driving an orange Lincoln shot at another driver on westbound I-94 near 12 Mile. The victim then exited at 9 Mile and waited at a gas station until police arrived. Police are now searching for that shooter. Lived in Inkster. Malcolm X lived in Inkster in 1952. And now that former home of the civil rights leader has been listed on the National Register of Historic Places. His former home is on 4336 William Street, and the museum will be dedicated to the life and work of Malcolm X. It's going to be run by the Inkster based nonprofit project. And we hope, it's called We Hope, Dream, and Believe. It's focused on educating and empowering young men and women.